Our next and last customer on stage is Vice President of System Solutions and Services at Cubic Transportation Systems, Dan Hedstrom. Welcome to Nara 17, Dan. Thank you for having me. So, Dan, you know, this demo that we saw, I know it, uh, it correlates very closely to your business. Um, can you tell us, audience, a little bit more about what Cubic does? Sure, uh, d definitely. So the interesting fact is that the majority of our audience have probably utilized Cubic technology or services. We're a leading provider of automated payment, intelligent transport systems, and fare collection for major cities around the world. If you've taken public transportation, Sydney, London, San Francisco, Los Angeles, any numerous other cities, you've actually used Cubic technology and services. In fact, we process about $50 million a day in fare collection. You, said, you say $50 million a day? $50 million a day, largely without any interruption. And without any interruption. So, I mean, I, I believe you know, you know, your role is ensuring that these transactions go through without any interruption. I mean, that must be really challenging. So tell us a little bit about some of these challenges that you face. Sure. So uh, collecting $50 million a day in transactions without, without interruption is difficult, especially in today's terms. Everything is interconnected. We know in any city, we might have 30 to 40,000 devices in the field. Managing of those devices with third-party providers, uh, payment collection providers, that technology is very difficult. That's what ServiceNow brings to the table. It helps us to synchronize our operations, synchronize that technology, and really understand how to deliver that service to the, pub to the patron of public transportation. And if that system goes down, that means that you, know, you cannot buy any tickets, you cannot you know, use any public transportation, uh, you know, trains, all of that is down pretty much. That's what the impact is, right? That is what the impact is. Uh, the good thing is that, that is very rare occurrence. Our job is to ensure that does not happen. So how is customer service management helping you to be proactive? I mean, you mentioned that you know, one of the uh, things is to bring all the systems together. But other than that, how else is customer service management helping you to be proactive in your business? Yeah, good question. So I, I mentioned everything is interconnected. We're heavily reliant upon third-party providers, technology, operations that is incredibly synchronized to provide that delivery of the service. I mean, we now have the ability to take a mobile phone, tap it on a gate, process that payment, open the gate, get that patron onto the public transportation. That's very difficult to do. The, the beauty of ServiceNow is that it takes all of those processes, integrates it into one single place. And not only does it allow us to, to harmonize those processes, it allows us to understand the technology that exists out in the field all the way to the back office or in the cloud. Seeing that one pane of visibility uh, allows us to proactively see incidents and resolve them before we actually make an impact to public transportation. That is just awesome. So it's really about connecting systems and data and processes analyzing them, giving you the visibility so you can react before outages happen. You got it. <laughs> All right. So what are some of the results that you are already seeing uh, with your use of customer service and some of the goals that you may have uh, for your business going sure. forward? Good, good question. So uh, it, it, we could probably sum it up in one word. And you mentioned earlier, visibility. I mean, historically, we're able to operate with discrete devices in the field. They can largely operate independently. In today's interconnected world, everything is on demand. It's real time. It relies upon significant amount of technology and the operations behind the scene. That visibility that ServiceNow provides to us allows us to continually look at our operations, continually improve our operations, and ensure that experience for the public transportation patron goes uninterrupted. And that is your directly correlated to your business goals as well. You got it. Awesome. So thank you very much for being here thank today, you for Dan. Me. And looking forward to your session. I think it's tomorrow. So Dan Hedstrom from Cubic Transportation. Now you heard me talk about customer service management, and you also heard from our customers on how ServiceNow's customer service management allows an effortless, connected, and proactive customer service. As I mentioned before, each and every of our customers, our Lightspeed pioneers, have sessions um, at this event. Our product is also on display and being demoed live at the demo pods. So I really urge you to attend our customer sessions, network with them, network with our partners, and meet our topic experts who are there at the demo pod. Because today, we're not just launching our customer service, um, 
our community's product. But today, I am personally inviting each and every one of you to come and join our customer service management community. So thank you very much, and hope you have a great Knowledge17. Thank you.